wall reveals wall reveals an indentation a notch and let's put one of those in in our building model we're going to go up to the architecture tab the wall we're going to go to wall reveal in the wall reveal when we hover over the building we are putting a reveal in notice up above we have horizontal or vertical uh, and I'm going to go with a vertical one first and I'm going to put like three of them along this I'll just put one here bam and I'm going to come up and do this again I'm going to go to architecture I'm going to go to wall go to reveal maybe I'll put two of them in. I think two looks better I'll put a second one in and I'll hit escape and now when I zoom in you can see I have a notch here and if I go in and take say let's take a look at a realistic view of this thing you'll see how those are notched on the wall and they give it more of a vertical element to it these wall reveals <clears throat> you can see you can see we get some false artifacts in here but uh, we do get some notching effect here so let's go back in and take another look at this go with a hidden line here and you can see that we have those notches in there we can also uh, when I pick on those reveals here uh, right, we have the reveal this is my um, instant properties over here that I can change these things here are, uh, are going to change this instance uh, if I go to the edit type I can change the family remember anytime I change the family I want to duplicate that and so I can come in here and say I want to change the profile so I can come in here and say oh I want to make it a different profile or something like that so a little different shape so remember whenever we are editing the type we are editing the family of this reveal so everything in this project will be changed in that family if I'm changing the instant just this particular instance of this reveal not that reveal will be updated when I change these instant properties of the reveal